Hey, you want to learn something useful? Come on, let's go. Hi, this is Chris at My Handyman, and I want to teach you how to do all those little jobs and chores around your house that I know that you can do without calling for help. Now, if this is your first time tuning into my channel, welcome. And please, please, please subscribe. There's a little red button here someplace. So just push that. If you're returning, welcome back for another lesson. And get ready. We're about to begin. Today what we're going to do is we're going to take some nails out of some trim. Um, I've been working on this place and I uh, had to take the trim off. Some of it I have to recut into different sizes because I put up new trim in some areas and some areas I can keep the, the old trim but I just have to cut little pieces from it. Now the piece that I'm going to be using here has got some significant nails that are coming through it. There we go, see? And what we're going to do is we're going to actually remove these nails. Now you would think that I'm going to try and hammer them this way and go through the face, the good part of the, of the wood. Well, let's find out and see what happens when we do that. So I'm going to go like this and pull you down like this. And we're going to try and do exactly that. All right, so I'm going to go back up like this. That one came out pretty good and I got myself a hole here and that's all right because that's where the nail came from. But the proper way of doing this because a lot of older trim like this, when you start to take the nail out by hammering it the opposite way and trying to pull it through this way, you mar up this area. You get this nothing but problems in this area. So this is actually how you're supposed to do it. All right? You got the nails here, you got the nails here. So what you want to do is you want to take your your channel locks and just rock them out just like that. You might mar up the back and that's okay, but you didn't wreck the front. All right? So let's see that again. We're going to go like this. Take it like that. Pull it up like that. The nail comes out and you can see it's bent. You can see that it's slightly bent. And that's because the nail was bent. Now if you tried to push it through the other side like that, there's a chance you're going to screw this up here. And then you'd have, you'd have more problems than you'd want. So that actually is the, the correct way of pulling out nails from your trim. Uh, it's pretty easy. It's pretty fast. Uh, any kind of problems you'd have beyond that, you just put a little bit of wood putty on there and, and you'd be fine. What you don't want to do is when you're renailing these in is to go through the same holes again because you won't have any grip. Okay, you've got um, basically the same size nail going through a, a, almost a little bit larger of a hole, um, but it's not going to grip very well. If you would please, there's some sort of a button down here. If you had a little red button for subscribe, if you would, please, if you'd subscribe, that would be wonderful. Thank you very much. Um, go to the website and, and check out some of the other videos I have on the video, um, uh, the video gallery. And don't let anybody ever tell you you can't do that. You can do this. If they can do it, you can do it. Just have them show you how, like I did. And I'll see you in the next video.